As the highly contagious Omicron variant sweeps through the population, testing sites have been bombarded. We've seen hours long waits. Courtney Friedman sorted out issues that KSAT viewers have had recently with two different testing companies. The majority of the free testing sites on the city of San Antonio's website are through Curative. This morning, some people were notified their appointments had been canceled. And when they went to the Curative website, it didn't show any operating sites in San Antonio. We began asking questions, and around 2 p.m., the Curative website began to show at San Antonio locations again with available appointments. Curative Communications Manager Pasquale Gianni told us the website had a temporary technical issue earlier on that was quickly fixed, and any cancellations due to that were resolved by our support team. One person whose appointment was canceled told KSAT it has since been rescheduled. The second testing update from Community Labs, a nonprofit that processes PCR tests in labs right here in San Antonio. Sunday, they announced a delay in results that today we found out was due to a shipping delay in Nashville caused by severe weather and short staff. Yeah, there were two, two small chemical components uh, that were not delivered by FedEx. We didn't get those components until Monday morning, and so, uh, you know, we got, we got behind on Friday, couldn't catch up on the weekend, and so we started catching up uh, yesterday. Community Labs President Sal Weber said there are people working in their lab 24 hours a day right now to catch up, meaning if you're waiting on test results from last week, it may take a little longer than the typical 24 hours to get those back. I would say within the next uh, 48 to 72 hours, we should be we should be caught back up. Weber said they haven't had a logistics problem for the past two years they've been offering tests and want people to confidently continue testing to stop the spread of COVID-19. Courtney Friedman, KSAT 12 News.